The clock is ticking for city and county governments to decide what they will use for their ARPA funds for. Blake Hill has been looking into this for Wichita County and Blake. We first reported in October of 2022 that $4.5 million was allocated to the Wichita Valley Water Supply Corporation for a major project, but not much progress you say has been done. Alyssa, the American Rescue Plan Act funds can be used for all sorts of projects to improve infrastructure. And by 2026, those funds need to be used. But when it comes to the, this water line project, there have been some significant delays. And it'll allow us to have a more diverse water system out there. All of those funds flow through Wichita Valley Water Supply Corporation. When four and a half million dollars was allocated for this project in October of 2022, the goal was to finish the project by the end of 2023. But they've had complications. Some residents don't want the pipeline running through their property. Due to the pushback, engineers have had to make adjustments to the pipeline's path, which means today they're just nearing the end of the planning stage. We're excited about that because it adds a lot of ability for people to that one haven't had water. All of their lives hadn't had water in that area. Some people have to haul water out there, especially when you get past halfway between Iowa Park and Burke Burnett up 369. Over the past few years, the county has allocated ARPA funds for different projects like the Waterline Project, courthouse renovations, and installing radio towers. According to Commissioner Watts, Wichita County has used every dollar it's been given. Most counties need to be fully, fully allocated by the end of 2024, meaning that if that you haven't planned to use the money you receive from the federal government, you only have till the end of this year to get that done. And if it's not, then there could stay a, a stand a chance of sending that money back. Commissioner Watts told me they have until the end of 2026 to complete the project, but he expects to finish much sooner. He says pipe should start going into the ground within the first half of this year. Blake Hill, News Channel 6.